Hey, y'all. Uh, thanks for staying. And before we leave, um, before I leave YouTube for the night, um, let's, um, let's pray for this seven-year-old that I saw this week that, um, he's in the midst of looking for a church home. Heavenly Father, um, let's pray for the Let's pray for this guy together. I know you know him. So I'm about to go to bed. But before I go to bed, let's pray together for this guy. Check this out. This this man, this well, he's seven years old. Right now, this seven-year-old is looking for a church home. Uh, he's looking for a better church home, though. Yeah. Yeah, I pray that this guy finds a better church. So if y'all want. And this is not to be joking around. This is to be serious. This is my prayers for the night. Alright. Let me turn off the camera. So you guys don't see my knees. Well, I'm wearing PJs, so it really doesn't matter. Um, I pray for this seven-year-old who knows the way church should and should not be. He knows that there's chaos going on in the church. He understands that church should not be the way he is going. I understand that pastors are misbehaving and not showing the right way to go. And this is serious. This is not to be playing around. This is real. I pray for this guy. He's seven years old and he already knows what real church is supposed to be like. And I pray for my pastor and his family. And I'm grateful for my pastor, DeAndre Salter, because he is what a real pastor is. He preaches God's word. And he just gets to the point and help this step, help that seven year old find a good church home in your hands and your power, Lord. Amen. All right. Now, Bear and I are going to go to bed now. Thanks for praying with me. Good night, everybody.